This slimy vegetable is a popular boba drink. This is taro. Taro? Taro. When I came here to the US, I saw taro in boba drinks and it was purple. So I thought it was ube. But when I looked into it, it was actually something that I would eat in a savory Filipino dish. I show you. The thing with taro is that it's slimy when you peel it, when you cut it, and especially after I cook it. It's funny because whenever I'd see taro boba drinks, it would typically be colored purple. But the taro that I typically see is like an off-white color. So maybe other taro variants are more purple? Well anyway, I like to put taro in savory soups. And today, I'm putting it in this Filipino tamarind soup called sinigang. I've also seen it used in a Filipino beef marrow soup. After I've fully cooked it, it's like eating a heartier potato that's a teensy bit slimy. I don't think it's as slimy as okra though. And I'd say that taro has a pretty neutral taste. It does not taste like boba at all. What about you? Have you tried taro yet? And if you have, in which dish?